Hi everyone, it is a pretty back here. Starting the week off right officially with a package. I know I did get a couple of decks yesterday in Value Village, but it's Monday. I got mail. This is from Magic Mike. As it turns out, it's from the Sorcerer Safari Magic Camp in Toronto, Ontario. That's pretty cool. If you've ever seen or been to or heard of the Tannins Magic Camp down in the US, very similar as far as I know. And let's see what we got here. First of all, we threw in a bonus deck, a Victoria deck. Uh, wasn't sure what to expect, but he's going to throw in there. It's pretty nice though, although I already have one. But um, then we get on to what else we got in here. There it is. Can get it out. Oh. Ah. Yeah, I know it's so difficult. He threw in an advertisement. Say so, yeah, See, it's floating. Little kid's making a uh, chip float. And there you go. This is a uh, social safari magic camp. Apparently, they've been in operation for 15 years and they're accepting people uh, sign ups for registrations for a summer session. Not sure if there's any other sessions outside of that, but obviously it's probably just a summer thing. Anyway, on top of that, we got this. This is what I was looking forward to. And, and there's one more card here. It's, it's a Sonsu Safari. Superstar Performer Cards, 2011 season. <laughs> um, I guess this is maybe something that you get when you go to as a member. Something it's got some information. Only professional magic camp in Canada. I have 20 campers from 8 to 25 years of age. Young with distance attend from all over the world. Held at the end of August for one week. Wow, a whole week. <laughs> um, so there you have it. They got this nice little card just in there. And it is what I've been waiting for. Mm -hmm. Wasn't cheap, but I got them anyway. It is very limited edition. 2015 52 plus Joker Club deck. It just seems like I got the other one. Actually, I did. I got it for in July for my birthday. There's a 204 out of 1,000. And 215 out of 1,000. Uh, hopefully... I will be able to cover my expenses on this by selling the deck in the future sometime. But that is that. Thanks again for this deck. Thanks again, Ma Magic Mike, for helping me out with these. And for all the other goodies, I will see you all next time with more. Hello, everyone. <clears throat> Features are afraid to back again. I am back. Finally, I got some mail. It's been a slow week. But I did finally get some mail today. Whether or not I get anything tomorrow. I don't know. But anyways, um, one of these I thought I was going to get yesterday. It didn't happen. And then there's another one that just showed up today I wasn't expecting. Let's get on to it. First of all, I got one here from Penguin Magic. Uh, like a Penguin Magic, they have a video. They, they do videos where they do boxings. So I'm doing the unboxing. They have a video. They sent me there's a receipt that shows them putting the thing together and putting the sticker on the envelope. They also sent a video to me, kind of like a thank you video. This is pretty cool. Anyways, this is the Honeybee Honeycomb back. It is the first official deck of cards from Penguin Magic, and it's about damn time they they do something. Here you go. Uh, printed by USPC, of course, and designed by, I believe it's designed by Randy Butterfield. Midnight cards. I'll confirm that. Next up, we got this. Which is from Drew. I guess that's the name of the company. Drew Phillips. Makes sense, Drew. What else we got in here?
there is a couple of hashtag Cincy 52 things. That's pretty cool. And then we get the deck. It's a Cincinnati 52 deck. Um, I'm not sure who produced it. Or if this is a prototype or what. But it was nice enough to send me one to review. So I appreciate that and I thank him. Uh, oh. Damn. <laughs> Anyways, it's all about Cincinnati. So I thought it'd be pretty cool. It's definitely not looking like a USB-C deck. Which is unfortunate. Because I thought it was. But anyways, moving along. I got one here from Gambler's Warehouse. I'm not too sure what it is. Obviously, it's Kickstarter related. Now, oh, it looks like it's one deck. Today, I... I'm going to make a mental prediction. Uh, oh, I was wrong. Not the one I was thinking. I thought it was going to be... Whatever, I forget the name. But it's not. It's actually another one I've been waiting on. Which is... The Four Seasons deck. We'll see how that goes. It's made by Expert Point Guards. So I got that. Got that, that, that. One more package. It's just from Legends Point Guards. I'm not too happy about this. It's, it's practically open. That's how it came. It's barely stuck sealed. And inside we have... Three of the Leonardo playing cards. The gold, I guess this is the silver, and the platinum. And there's been some issues with this limited edition platinum one because he was promising certain things and, And apparently it's not delivered. Like, they're supposed to be gilded edges. It wasn't gilded. There was supposed to be an iridescent thinness. Which is a foil thinness. And that apparently didn't happen. So a little bit disappointing. But that's that. That's what I got today. Finally some mail. I'll see you next time. With more.